Hey, welcome back to Mr. Meal's Music. I'm Anthony Meal. Here's how you play the game, Let Us Chase the Squirrel. Get your students in a big circle, and they're going to be holding hands. I call these students the acorns. Now there's going to be one student that gets to be the squirrel. While all the students are holding hands, the one squirrel is going to put their hands up like this, and they're the squirrel's mouth. So while the song is going, the squirrel stays where they are, and the acorns are going around in a circle. So they'll be going... Let us chase the squirrel up the hickory, down the hickory, let us chase the squirrel. And on the final phrase, up the hickory tree. And then on the final rest, the squirrel goes down and they catch an acorn. Now, from this point on, the squirrel, they eat the acorn. So they are now holding the hands with the student that they just caught. So I tell the students that the squirrel is growing. Every acorn they eat, it helps the squirrel grow and get bigger and bigger. Now, if you've played apple tree with your students, this is a big surprise for them because with the apple tree, it's just two people. But as the squirrel keeps catching more and more um, acorns, the squirrel just keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger, and they're allowed to catch more acorns at a time. So there are going to be rounds where the squirrel catches two or three or four acorns at a time. Eventually, the squirrel gets so big and there aren't very many acorns left, so I let the acorns let go of hands and they just travel through the squirrel's mouth until there's one or no acorns left. Now, as the game goes, I like to rotate the squirrel so that when the acorns are going through, new students have the opportunity to have the acorns go under their arm. This is for kiddos that you really, really can trust because this can get a little wild. Um, once the squirrel gets uh, about four, five, or six kiddos big, um, then I have the squirrel get a little antsy. So the squirrel is holding hands and their arms are up and they're going to the beat like this. So it's going to go, let us chase the squirrel. Up the hickory, down the hickory, let us chase the squirrel up the hickory tree. And when they're doing that, the acorns have to go around a chair and through the squirrel's mouth and out of the squirrel's mouth and around another chair. And I have the chair set up so that the acorns don't just go in one window and out the next window. They have to go all the way through the big, huge squirrel's mouth. If you look at the diagram right over here, this is kind of what it looks like. Um, this is super, super fun um, because the squirrel that's just been like this for the whole game finally gets to um, get their wiggles out. I hope this has been helpful for Let Us Chase the Squirrel. Really, really, really fun game. Um, great for teaching Do, Re, Mi, for introducing Re. This is a big song that I use. Um, if you have any questions, please uh, comment below. Please share and subscribe somewhere around here. Take care. Bye-bye.